Bmg Drive with Wabby Yar. Let's uh, let's play with some cars. Uh, that sounds weird to say that, but we're gonna do that, and I mean multiples. So we're gonna go to a map that'll probably cause some terrible lag. We'll cry my computer, make my computer cry. I should say, not cry my computer. That's some weird grammar right there. But start with two. There is. A, I thought this one had more. Oh well, we'll start with two. Then we'll go to more and more and more intelligence. It's ridiculous. So what we're gonna look at though is a flatbed. It's somewhere in this list of cars which keeps growing more and more and I can never find anything anymore. It needs a search button. Just hit flat and then be like, oh yes, that one. Okay, let me see here. Da 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 na 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 there it is. Right in between Mitsubishi and Flip Ramp. So we're gonna use the box uplift one because that one works, I think. I think that's the one that works. I can't remember for sure. Yeah, that's the one that works. The other ones I don't like if you use the other ones it's kinda weird. If you use that one, you see, you're kind of, yeah. I don't know where the rest of my wheels went. They're there, because they can make skid marks, but I don't know where they are. It's kind of weird. Same with the stripped one. It's Well, actually, I think the stripped one works okay, doesn't it? No, it's the same way. <laughs> it's the same way. I was mistaken. And then there's a blank one, which is even more useless. It's like, yep, that's the same exact thing. What's the point? The fun one is the cargo box van. So remember that. If you get the... What, this vehicle, the flatbed, you want the cargo box uplifting happy van. Because it's uplifting. Anyways, we're gonna not go over the ramp. I was illusioning it like I would. Or I did an illusion like I was getting it, but then I didn't. I'm like, uh uh, we ain't going up this ramp. No way. So, what we're gonna do is we're gonna park this thing right here. Just splat right there. Yeah. Right there. Put the parking brake on, and we're gonna bring this truck over, and we're gonna put it right on it. Just splop right truck right here, right on this thing, and then we're gonna drive it on around on a flatbed. So, careful! There we go, that's good enough. The only way to secure it is hit the parking brake and hope it stays. Alright, now maximum flatbed power, go! Oh! Oh! Car, you're not staying on. Try this again. Get a better. Uh... Oh no, you don't need. You're not supposed to drive. You're supposed to drive. I I couldn't remember which one had the parking brake and which did. I'm like parking brake on, off, on, off, on, off. Oh nope. Yeah, there we go. Now we're moving. All right. So put this thing right on this thing, real careful, like. And that doesn't have the parking brake on. I can fix this. This has gone terribly. Let's try. Oh god, I made the truck inside of the other truck. Parking brake is on now. Let's try that one more time. I'm sorry, that was terrible. The first seven tries, eight tries a charm or whatever. Maybe this was third, fourth, fifth. I'm not counting. I know it's too many tries though. That was terrible. I mean, it's not like it's an easy thing to do, but hey, what are you doing? You're supposed to be right here. What are you doing, man? You're fired. Seriously, you know what? I got a better idea. How about this? I just put splat. There. It even stays better like that. Look at that. It stays. Now we can drive around with our little truck that has a truck on it. And you gotta brake all the time when it looks like it's gonna fall off. Make sure it doesn't. Looks like the wheel got stuck in the trailer right there, so that means it's secure. So let's go full speed ahead with this thing. Let's see if it'll stay on. Oh, don't tip. Don't tip. Don't tip. All right. Looking good. Looking good. I got this thing. It's not going nowhere. Oh, it's going over there, though. But that's not nowhere. That's somewhere. So it doesn't count. It'd be cool if this thing had a slide out ramp. You just slide out the ramp and pick it back up. It don't, though. Alright, so that's, uh... Let's use a smaller car, maybe. Maybe that's the problem. What are you doing over here? You stop that. You go... Oh my god, you dented my beautiful flatbed. How dare you. Fresh car. Fresh car. Don't want dents all over it. We'll use something small like the little Bishu. Whoops, that's not Bishu. There we go. Use the rally edition because we're going to be not on roads. We're going to be on a vehicle. I don't know which would have better grip. 
Hopefully the rally edition has enough. Oh, hey, I got an idea. How about we drive it from here? What would happen? Parking brake off. Maybe that'd be better, actually, if I had it with the... Hold the accelerator for the blue car. Maybe that'll make it stay on. Uh, I mean, it kind of looks like it's staying. Except for when I turn. And it looks like it's going to fall off. If I'm careful with the turns, it should stay on. It works. Sort of. It makes a mess of smoke. That is for sure, but it kind of works. I mean, I don't know how it's staying on, really. It's going to fall off eventually. I just... It's a matter of time. I think it's kind of inside of the interior of the truck, so that's not good. Oh, goodness. Right. Oh. Guess what? Hey, we're still good to go. It's all fine. I'm going to open a trucking business where we transport cars. I'm pretty confident in my abilities. I mean, this car is pretty much undamaged except for the damage. If it wasn't for the damage, it'd be undamaged. Oh my goodness, but this is not doing well on my computer. Stay with me. Stay with me, little bishu. Stay with me here. I don't even know if the, 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 the flatbed's staying with me at this point. We can barely move. Try to climb this thing. We never climb this thing. Oh. That was a dumb idea. Now we're totally stuck. Alright, let's try parking it then. See how that does. So, park it. How does that do? Parking is way worse. Oh, if, look at that. It fell off already. I think, you know, I think the best solution is slam it into it so they become one vehicle, basically. Nah, that's crooked. Like, actually get the front of this car into the cab of that. And I'm sorry the way the game running, man. It's just like, there's two cars. My computer's freaking out. It's like, oh, why are you doing this to me? I'm only a 4.5 gigahertz house. Well, why you do this? It's like, really? I don't... You should be better. Alright, so there we go. We shoved it in. Look at the way it bends the bed. That's trippy. Do you see the bed? It bends. Anyways, we are in there. And ready to go. Transporting is good to go. Look at that. Look how stable this thing is. I could go drifting and it would stay on. I think I broke it. The tires aren't spinning on the blue car anymore. Tires don't spin no more. Alright, let's try to get it off by smashing sideways into this. Oh, that was a slow crash and... Blue car is still there. Blue car is staying great. It's making a lot of mess. I'm smoking everywhere, but it's oh goodness, here's a bad idea. Oh Fortunately that broke it my car. Here's an even better idea. What if we put one of the same thing on the sun? So we get two of them and we put a flatbed on my flatbed. We're gonna flatbed the flatbed. Alright, this is getting dumber and dumber by the minute. How many flatbeds could we do, I wonder? This is really getting dumber and dumber by the minute. Okay, so I'm gonna duplicate those. Whoop! Ah, they're the wrong type. And now they're upside down. So expect a lag fest. But we're gonna have four flatbeds, dang it. Alright, so the first flap is there. And the next one, we gotta make these the right kind of vehicle. So, correct vehicle. Correct vehicle. Now we gotta separate them, because they're fighting. Okay. 
So, first we put one on the line. And, oh man, this is gonna make my computer cry so much, but hey, it might be worth it. Oh! Okay, one. I should put the parking brake on on that one. I got bad news. This thing is trying to go in reverse and it's just not moving. Okay, let me put the parking brake on, then put the vehicles on it. Is that hitting? I guess it is hitting. Parking brake on. I can't... Good thing I checked. It was parking brake was already on because I was clicking it non-stop trying to figure things out. And now it's on. Now we're good to go. Okay. Move this one up just a smidge. Close enough. Next! Who's next? You have to respawn this one. It has a glitch in its bed. And oh, computer, stop crying. It'll be over soon enough. We just want to flap add this thing out real quick, okay? My FPS is just shot. Oh, come on. Okay, that's fine. Don't fall, don't fall, you last guy. Don't fall, Asud. There we go. This is not working out at all. This is dumb as can be. But basically, I never described this actually. This was made by just basically removing the sides of the box chuck. That's all it was, I think. I think that's the normal floor that's usually there. And the lag fest continues. Four! Oh, that's close. Okay, now the first one fell off. I don't think we can do more than two on a truck. And even then, it can't really pull them along. <laughs> it was a dumb idea anyways. I gotta do something about these cars, though. Alright, that should make it a bit better. Oh, dang it. I deleted the original card, and I don't know how to... There's some way to get back to the car, but I don't know it off the top of my head. Um, right, okay. Uh, I'll be right back. Whee, I fixed it. Good news. That's great news, actually. Great news, I fixed it. I don't know what else we're going to really do. I think we're actually pretty much done, but we could try putting a couple more cars on it just for fun. And then we'll go ahead and finish things up. So it's right here, the flatbed cargo box uplift. Uplift my spirits. I know I said that before, but it's every time I see that name, that's what I think of. Like an uplifting vehicle, you know? Alright, so let's just place it right about here. Reset, nice and fancy. Fancy, fresh, uh, undamaged vehicle, and let's make this a four-wheel drive off-road edition to make it a little bit more durable, and maybe the four-wheel drive will make it hopefully cling to that better because I'm not going to use a parking brake. I'm going to keep accelerating into the truck because I think that works better than parking brake. Smash it right into it. Doesn't seem like it's uh, wanting to play nicely. Let me try that again. The way it hit the truck was just not good. Slowly. I don't know why the game's so slow for me. It's like I really don't have much. There's like really like only three processors in the market that are faster than mine. It's like I don't have much choice in the matter. This is not gonna work. Oh well. Turns out it's hard to be a car a car delivery man. And I just hit my microphone. That's a terrible end. I give up. <laughs> Should try it one more time, I guess. But this ain't easy. Where are you going? I think the other car worked better, turns out. Because it's better to be able to fit the car on the trailer than uh, not. 
What are you doing? Who said you could go that way? Get, your, get back here and be ready, you lazy bum. That's a perfect landing, actually, I think. There we go. We can transport this car. Let's go do some transporting. And we will try to take a turn around this thing and then we'll do some jumps. Okay. That's good. We made a turn. A whole U-turn, actually. It's 180 degrees. Now here's for the tricky part. Come on! Oh, it's mostly stayed. It's it's become part of the interior of my transporting truck, but the red truck has stayed. Oh goodness. Oh no, wait. It's fine. We are fine still, don't worry. One bit. Let's do the jump again. Oh no! No! Wrench! Whoa! I broke it. With that catastrophic, catastrophic failure of uh, physics, I'm going to end the video. So, until next time, this is YBR. I'll see ya.